I was going to stop it anyway. And then he drops that line in and I'm like, oh, Jesus, that one hit me hard unexpectedly. Hey guys, how you doing out there? I'm Don. Welcome to the channel Rockin' a Country. I'm looking forward to this because this is long overdue that I do a reaction to Dan Seals. I don't know this song, so it's a true reaction, as most of them are. Everything that glitters is not gold. This was requested by a bunch of you. So I'm just going to get into this, right? Dan Seals, and it's a, a performance. Now, because, you know, I'm in the video that's part of it, I try to stay out of the way, which is why I'm off to the corner when I do these reactions instead of the middle, because I like to feature the artist prominently, but I may have to disappear once in a while and just cut myself out in the event that I'm blocking something, you know, depending on how they shoot the vid, how the video has been shot. So here we go. Within reason, of course. Saw you picture on poster in a cafe out in Phoenix. Guess you're still the sweetheart of the rodeo. Wow. As for me and a little Casey, we still make the circuit. In a one-horse trailer and a mobile home and She still asks about you all the time And I guess we never even cross your mind About you and the way you used to ride down the stones and your sequins, sunlight on your hair. We'll always love you. As for me, I've come to know everything that will. It's not gold Well, old Red, he's getting older And last Saturday he stumbled But you know I just can't bear To let him go Our little case, she's still growing and she started asking questions And there's certain things A man just does not know Her birthday came and you never even called Damn! Ah, I didn't see that coming That part of it I was going to stop it anyway, and then he drops that line in, and I'm like, oh, Jesus, that one hit me hard unexpectedly. Her birthday came, and you didn't call. There's so much in this thing is just so true. All right. I, I mean, don't get that upset with me for stopping. I mean, these things hit me, too. And if you sit in YouTube a reaction channel and see, when you're taking songs in and contemplating, the level of focus is so much deeper. And then you've got these consummate... Uh, iconic world known musicians in the background artists in the background with him and i'm like and his voice is butter holy cow now another half the song to go Whew. i guess we never cross your mind at all but then sometimes i think about you and the way you used to ride down In your ride songs and your sequins With the sunlight on your hair the crowd will always love you As for me, I come to know Everything that glitters is not gold Everybody said you'd make it big someday And I guess that we were only in your way It's 
Someday I'm sure you're going to the coast. Yeah, you do. Most for everything you win, there's something lost. About you and the way you used to ride out in your rhinestones and your sequins with the sunlight on your hair and all oh, the crowd will always love you. As for me, I've come to know everything with her is not. Everything is not gold. Thank you very much. So, uh, you know, some people, you know, you're in the presence of all these artists, you know, and you get to know them and they become friends of yours as well. And there's a camaraderie and, and then you really, you know, everybody's a human being, you know, and I don't mean that in a pithy way. I mean, first we can sort of like idolize or lionize these people and they're like, they're all of this. But then you get to know people and then you realize that they're scared about things. They've got issues. They've got things that whatever, they're people. But some people when you rise to a different level when they're in the presence of folks like that instead of shrinking they draw inspiration from them i don't know if that happened with dan seals or not i know you know I, when i used to follow you know the nba and magic johnson and larry bird and michael jordan years and isaiah thomas and back then and guys like magic and bird fed off of one another you know especially when they played each other, there was this a heightened level of intensity. They weren't intimidated. They took their game to another level. And that's what I saw. It felt like Dan was doing here. Like he just didn't even have a moment of doubt whatsoever that he was in the right space. I mean, maybe I'm overanalyzing it. I mean, I've done that before, but I mean, yeah, I can't talk to him. So this is what I have. But what a gorgeous song. I mean, it's so true. And most of the time I'm listening to these lyrics and I'm thinking this is normally a song that I'd hear a female artist sing where the male artist is off on the road and he just forgot about the family. He didn't even call the girl on her birthday, but it wouldn't have been, I don't think it was originally, it may have originally been written and then they switched it up a bit, some of the lyrics. But when he said, you know, she's starting to ask questions. And so I get the sense that she's probably 10 to 12 years old, you know, and as the song's being depicted, and uh, maybe 13, 14, but usually the questions for girls start a little earlier than that. And he's like, a man isn't prepared for those questions. And it's that kind of import. And that's just true. It's just a girl needs, you know, the best, they need their mother. You know, they need their mom. They need a female to answer these female type questions. So political correctness aside, because that's, you know, so much of that's horseshit in my opinion, but that's as deep as I'll get with that. So, oh gosh, I got to rate this thing. His voice, what came across in those lyrics, it was a sliver of life. Oof, it's so close to a 10. I'm coming in at a 9.8. It's just a true song. It's, it's just a true song. And I have a... Uh, Soft spot in my heart, you know, I have a soft spot in my heart for a lot of things and people, but the young ladies, you know, trying to make it through this world, it's difficult being a woman. I don't know if it's more difficult. I think it is. That's just my sense. I mean, um, and so when they have questions, you know, they need answers, you know, and it's difficult. You're going to be the baby carriers in this world. You're going to give birth. And that's a whole different lifestyle it's a whole different mindset a way of being than the guy i mean we feel pain just like you guys do but it's not just about that it's about how to figure out how to best 
live life, make sense of the world, you know, when, when you have kids, how to keep them alive and all that. But in this song, she's gone. She's, the mom isn't there, that, you know. Um, and he's trying. And the girl will know that. When she grows up, she'll figure it all out and know that daddy did what he could do to make it work. But I'm coming in with a 9.8 on that. Uh, yeah. So to all the folks who requested that, thank you. That's a gorgeous song. That goes in the playlist of songs of a 9+. And now there's probably a hundred songs in there because you guys request phenomenal songs. So that's it. All right. Dan Seals, Everything That Glitters Is Not Gold. Uh, in the presence of Whale and Willie, Roy Clark and others, you know, you guys can name them too. That's it. Have a great day, guys. I'll see you in another video. Keep rocking the country.